Hello and welcome to the Octane High Tech Awards in Orange County, California. I'm Jane King. The Gate 5 system is an innovative yet simple process that completely eliminates sewage, sludge, and animal and food waste. And with me is Steve Delson, the CEO and founder of Gate 5, and then also Lisa Hines, a board member and also a co-founder yeah. of Gate 5 as well. So welcome. Um, Steve, let's start with you. Explain the Gate 5 system in the process. Certainly. Okay, thank you very much. We have developed a sustainable and innovative uh, infrastructure that will transform material that's long been considered a waste and simply discarded, but it has uh, calorific value, it has uh, energy value. Uh, it has as much energy value as coal, but it's not a fossil fuel. And what we do is we take this material and we dry it, and then we mill it into a fine powder, and we combust the powder, and uh, we use, utilize uh, well-proven equipment to do this and uh, produce renewable energy and other, other products. Yeah, and Lisa, I want to talk to you about that. So you're creating renewable resources. So explain, elaborate on that a little bit. What exactly are you I creating? Just, I want to say that we're talking about, I think, one of the nastiest things I can think of as a waste, sewage. Human waste, mm -hmm. sewage is... And it, we treat it and have treated it as a waste. It is a waste. We spend a lot of money managing it and treating it. But really, we're finding out through this technology, it's a resource, literally, like it's a sustainable, continually renewable resource. So doing managing the waste with Gate 5's technology, you actually end up with renewable energy and clean water, and there's building material as well. Then, then also, the way we manage sewage today, you, there's a lot of methane created in the process. So in this process, there's no methane created. And since we eliminate it, we don't have to truck things. So today, the way we do it, we basically dry it and come up with something that we have to haul a long distance and then somehow land manage it. There'll be none of that, which also helps our environment and the oceans mm. to be cleaner. And then on top of that, it costs less, it's about half the cost to do it this way with this technology than what they do today at the wastewater treatment plants. Yeah, interesting. And I believe methane is one of the main contributors, right, to mm -hmm. greenhouse gases and- Exactly. Yeah, so. It would be a big contributor to fighting climate change. Mm. Now, Steve, what role does the EPA, other environmental bodies play in your company and how you do business? Well, wastewater treatment plants basically doing, been doing things the same way for over close to 100 years now. Uh, however, however, regulations uh, are becoming more and more restrictive. Mm -hmm. And today's wastewater treatment processes have trouble um, meeting the requirements of, of the agencies like the, the EPA or CalRecycle or any number of other agencies charged with protecting public health and the environment. Our system will address all of these problems and by eliminating the waste altogether and turning it into usable resources. Yeah. Something productive. So, yeah. It's amazing to me. Now, Lisa, are your customers municipalities? Are they households? Both? They're, they're, our primary customers are municipalities. So the wastewater treatment plants that, you know, yeah. they are our, the way we manage waste today through our public agencies. Um, but then after that, we'll be looking toward agribusiness mm -hmm. and toward food waste. Because with them using the Gate 5 system, they become much more sustainable yeah. as well. Steve, is this scalable? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. our, our system is scalable for, it can be uh, scaled to very small for uh, villages in, in frontier and developing countries, all the way up to uh, serve metropolitan areas throughout the world. We will be initially introducing this system in the United States, but we'll spread it spread across the rest of the world over time, and uh, we'll be doing both uh, building and selling these systems to municipalities, building, owning, and operating these systems, and outside of our uh, area where we, can, where we can comfortably work, we will be licensing this technology throughout the world. There's, six, there's eight billion people in the world, only two billion of them are, have access to sanitation, so it's a it's a huge market that, need, that needs attention. Uh, diseases and, and yeah. health are, are very much of a concern, as are 
climate-related issues. Definitely addresses a lot of yeah. problems that we have in a global it, it society does. now. So, Lisa, finally, what's the growth strategy of the company? What we're doing right now is we are um, installing. So we're going to install and operate our first unit at Rancho Santa Margarita Wastewater Industry. It's right here. They're, they're a progressive wastewater agency here in Orange County, okay. California. We'll install it and operate it, and then, as Steve was saying, it's just sort of a, we'll build out in the West, and then we have that three-prong approach, mm -hmm. which you just said. So basically, build, own, and operate, build and sell, and license. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, oh, great oh, to hear about the company, exciting. Gate 5. Yes. Strange thing that's an asset. <laughs> well, you know, we'll take where we can get it, right? Whatever exactly. we can do. So. There you go. Thank, Thank you, you Jane. Steve. Yep. It was wonderful to be here. Thanks.